Yes, you just heard about how much the water levels have been rising on Lake Freeman. Freeman has been drained over the summer to protect endangered mussels in the Tippecanoe River. Now, while those water levels on Freeman are higher today, no one knows how long that will last. Now we go to News 18's Brittany Tyner, who is live on Lake Freeman with more. Brittany. Alex, as you can see, it appears as though the water levels here on Lake Freeman are back to normal. As News 18 has been reporting, the federal government mandates that Oakdale Dam keep its water flow at 500 cubic feet per second down the Tippecanoe River to protect endangered mussels. That has caused levels on Freeman to drop drastically in the past couple of weeks. Now, it's hard to tell that levels were ever low. Monticello and Delphi were hit with five and a half inches of rain throughout the night and early morning. Carroll County EMA Director Dana Jeffries says the water's also up because of that open floodgate at the Norway Dam on Lake Schaefer. He doesn't expect these normal water levels to stick around, though. He says once they fix that floodgate, he expects the levels to drop again here on Freeman. He says at this time, the levels from the Oakdale Dam here on Freeman are below flood stage. News 18, of course, will continue to monitor these levels and bring you the latest information. Also, a note to pass along. Because of the large amount of rain, the second shift of the kill floor department at Indiana Packers in Delphi needs to report to work tonight at 6 o'clock. Reporting live here from Lake Freeman, Brittany Tyner, News 18.